Hi, my name's Ellen and I'm a career counsellor here at Enhancif. And every day, data scientists use our Enhancif editor to create their perfect resume. So I actually wanted to show you how you can do the same today. Um, so I've used this resume as an example because I really like the length. It's one page and only includes the relevant information. What I would say though, is that it needs a summary, okay? So you can simply add that by clicking add section and putting it right at the top. If it's not right at the top, it won't be read by a recruiter. And the summary is good because you can basically tailor your resume to that job description. Take the key terminology from the job description and put it in here. So include words such as data visualization, machine learning methods. Talk about your programming skills if you have exceptional Python, for example. Um, and that will basically give you a bit more direction with the resume. It will also maximize your chances of getting through an ATS system, which is going to be the first obstacle when you apply online. It checks for your keywords and matches it to the job description. The next thing I'm going to go to is actually the content in this experience section. So you only want to include maybe three to five responsibilities here, but you need to show the actual impact you delivered to the company. So here they tell you what they did, but here they show the result of their actions on the business. And this will get you way further in an interview process if you can talk about exactly what you delivered and make sure you can quantify your actions. The next thing as well I will talk about is this tech stack here. So obviously within data science, there's a huge broad range of tech tools that you can use. And the best thing that about our Enhancer platform is that here you can actually group them together. For example, here, if you wanted to label this as your programming languages, you can just show group name and type it in here. If you've got cloud computing, just put that in there. And that will make sure it's a lot easier for a recruiter to identify and read. And if you incorporate all of these aspects into your resume, you're way more likely to get that interview request. So good luck.